Well, we know remodeling your home can certainly add to its value, but it can also make it more functional, more livable, and of course, more marketable if you do want to put it on the market. Designer Tammy Michaels with Inside Out on Como 1000 is here this morning. Always good to have you along. Thank you. We're talking small homes, yes. but big layouts because yes. of open design and concept. Yes, this open concept is so popular. It's the number one thing I get asked about as a designer, and I am a licensed bonded <laughs> general contractor, so people want to take out their walls. How do you go about doing something like that in, in a lot of these smaller homes, though? Well, the first thing that I want to tell people is physics and gravity is always going to win. So, you know, what we want to make sure is that we have a structural engineer, we have proper permitting, and we reinforce the structure. So, you know, and then I wanted to all look like all the pieces, talk to each other, have continuity with the design. Yeah. That makes it look more open. Be ready to be comfortable in your environment for a while because there's going to be changes in between yes, the two, right? Yes. You have some great examples, though, to show us Thank of what you. the final product can look like. Yeah, this is your average smaller house in the greater Seattle area. Uh -huh. Very cute, very charming, but if you got inside this house, it would look pretty small. Yeah. So this is more of that open concept. So you look inside, it looks huge because we've knocked out walls from the dining room, the kitchen, and here's what you see. Voila. Now, how do you tie this together? Well, it's all the wood. The wood floors. Look at the wood countertops, the yeah. wood cabinets. And it all looks like it's how I say the pieces are having a conversation with each other. I, I love this. This is another great picture, too. And you actually see there's a, a post or a beam in the yes. middle. Here. That's just, I, you, you mentioned gravity. Physics. Yes. You have to be able to support the roof, right? Exactly. And so people go, I don't want a beam. And I say, you know what? If you're going to see it, feature it. Yeah. So that's what in that photo it did is you've got to see that that structural support beam and just feature it embrace it make it part of the design yes element. gable roofs you mentioned as well yes so this is that pointed roof and so many people look at these homes but we knock out those roofs all the time see here you see typical seattle house mm -hmm. with a gabled roof and so then when you go inside there again open concept but now this time we did something that I love which is they want traditional yeah. things and a more contemporary open feel. And I think we should point out I mean this is the same is this the same house that we saw from the front or could be I it guess? It could be. It could yes. be. Gotcha because that I mean that kitchen looks enormous. It, it does it does and so but it is typical that it looks very grand uh -huh. especially with those gable roofs. I love them. I have that in my own house and I've embraced yeah. it. The vaulted ceilings are always yes. so nice. Kitchens of course always big for any remodel. Exactly. Exactly. But then, you know, we also want to make sure that we talk about in these smaller houses, people have tiny bathrooms. Oh, that's true. So I have a trick on this, which is, you know, oftentimes you have dormers, you have smaller spaces. So what I say is embrace lighter tile, lighter, you know, lighter countertops. And see, look at that glass shower, the white tub, the yeah. white tile, the white sink. There's even a toilet in there. That's a tiny bathroom. So light and airy, and you can see the dormers. Voila. You've got a gorgeous design. And when you do these designs, if you're going to remodel a home, it's in the kitchen and the bathrooms usually that you get the best return. That isn't is it? absolutely correct. Gotcha. So we want you to have an open concept, and I just want everybody to be safe. Hire a structural engineer. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Tammy. <laughs> Thank you. We appreciate it. We'll see you again here in two weeks. We'll be right back.